Right, so we have the integral of x to the power of 2x multiplied by 2 log of x plus 2 dx. And this is kind of a tricky integral because we have this factor out the front of x to the power of 2x. Now this is a function of x to the power of another function of x. So let's try a substitution of u equals x to the power of 2x. So we, we want to get rid of this term essentially. And to do this, we need to be able to differentiate this. Now, since we have a function to the power of another function, we can use this trick where we can write for any number y, we can write it as e to the power of log of y. And that's because the log is the inverse of the exponential. So if we do this, we can write u as e to the power of log of x to the power of 2x. And now where that's helpful is because we can use the laws of logarithms where we can bring down this power, the 2x inside the bracket, out the front. So this is the same as e to the power of 2x times log of x. And this is really nice because now we have something we can differentiate. So if we do this, we have du equals, so we need to use a chain rule, differentiate the function in the exponent first. We have 2 times log of x plus uh, 2x times 1 of x. This is the product rule. And then we, using the chain rule again, we still have the original function because the derivative of the exponent is just itself. So we have e to the 2x log of x. And they also need a factor of a dx here. So now we can simplify this. We have du, so we have 2 log of x. And then the x and the 1 over x cancel, we have 2 log x plus 2. And since we have the same function we started off with, I'm just going to replace this by uh, the original one we started, so x power of 2x dx. And now we can see why we did this, because this whole thing is exactly what we have under the integral. Just a slightly different order, but it's exactly the same. So we can just go ahead and use the substitution to write this integral as the integral of du. There's no factors of u, it's just the integral of 1 du. So that's really simple, it's as simple as it can be. We can obviously integrate this to get u plus c. And then just our answer is going to be in terms of x, so we just write x to the power of 2x plus c. So that's just kind of that's just kind of a, a long way around to see that the antiderivative of this function is just x to the power of 2x, and that's our answer.